With the new year here, you might be thinking about ways to get a fresh start, but what about a fresh start for your kids with time away from their phone? There's more to reality than what we are experiencing through our electronic devices, whether it's cell phone or whether it's on a laptop or playing video games. So to help start you on your journey, we turn to Ramiz Audi, the medical director for Arizona's Children Association. First up, set time boundaries. It's actually recommended for kids to be online for two hours or less each day. I particularly tell my patients' parents no more than an hour just because I feel like there's always that struggle with enforcing boundaries. When setting up the time boundaries, set your expectations. It's important that them and the children come together, they talk, they compromise, they have an understanding of what it is they're going to be doing with their electronic devices, how long they're gonna be on there, and what intention. Ramiz recommends writing those intentions down on a piece of paper and placing it on the fridge to make sure everyone's maintaining those boundaries. Next, remove any distractions. The best way to minimize distractions would be to turn off your notifications, but also to go into the apps and filter the content. Unfollow or block anybody or any group that you feel like it's giving you a negative experience. Try setting a routine every day to create good habits for the future. Making sure that at a certain time every day, you put your phone aside so you can focus on other responsibilities, which would be either family time, doing your homework, social activities, physical activities, because we want to make sure that we have an overall mind-body health balance. Next, it's time to tailor these tips for your lifestyle. So it's important to understand what is your ultimate goal with using social media? How do you think it's going to benefit you? And then when you write down those goals, then you set the boundaries of how much and what your expectation will be for being on these electronic devices or these social media apps. So set down the phone and start enjoying the real world, making moments with the ones you love. We're helping you take a break with three tips for a digital detox.